Our first speaker is Apana Desmuk. Hello everyone, this is Aparna Deshmukh, a PhD student in Civil and Environmental Engineering at UW and my advisor is Dr. Konstantin Sobolev. My thesis topic is Nano-Engineered Composites for 3D Printing of Concrete Auxetic Structures. When I first came to US in 2017, my Milwaukee friends told me that Milwaukee has three seasons, winter, summer and construction. The roads in Milwaukee are always under construction and people have to deal with detouring very frequently. The road pavements buckle due to extreme temperature variations ranging from as low as minus 18 Fahrenheit in winters and as high as 90 Fahrenheit in summer. The pavements cannot accommodate these changes in temperature and results in cracking and buckling of the surface layers. So, as a solution to this problem, I introduce oxidic concrete which can accommodate this expansion as well as contraction. So what are oxidic materials? Normal material when stretched in vertical direction, it contracts horizontally but the oxidic material when stretched vertically, it expands horizontally that is it fattens. So if you see in the slide the hexagonal shape repetitive structures when pulled in y direction contracts in x direction but the new geometry beside it when pulled expands in x direction. This unusual behavior of material helps to accommodate the expansion and contraction and keeps the structure in a good shape. Though it is called oxidic material but this unusual behavior is not due to material but due to geometrical arrangement of certain shapes. This concept is being used in shoes but it is not very common in construction. My project is to come up with the geometrical shape that will exhibit oxidic behavior and can be produced using concrete for the application of payments. But casting oxidic material is difficult and time consuming due to its complex geometry. So we opt for 3D printing of concrete. But conventional concrete is not suitable for printing. So another important challenge for my project is to design a concrete mix which will be easily flowable through the 3D printer nozzle but at the same time it should get stiff as soon as it gets out from the nozzle to avoid collapse. And this type of mixture can be achieved by addition of nano sized particles which will enhance the properties of concrete mix and make it suitable for 3D printing. The application of oxidic concrete is not only limited to pavements but can be used wherever there is wide temperature variation. So may it be on earth or on extraterrestrial bodies such as moon where the temperature changes from 260 degree Fahrenheit during daytime and minus 280 degree Fahrenheit during nighttime. So in near future when we reach on moon we will see oxidic concrete serving the purpose.